cooking I'll go out cooking something up with me Get it together! <laughs> Take three! <laughs> was the uh, low-carb Philly cheesesteak stuffed peppers. Well, tonight, we're going to have those for supper. So, I thought, well, for my Tasty Tuesday episode this week, I will show you guys how I'm going to cook these. So, as I figured I probably would, I forgot to take them out of the freezer last night. So, I did this morning. They're thawed. They're thawed pretty good. They thawed more than I thought they were, actually. So, uh, I'm going to uh, take them out of the package and put them in a uh, baking dish. This is just a, you know, a small... I can't remember. Anyways, I can't remember. Well, that one's still a little froze a little bit. So, we'll, really, we'll see how this, uh, how they cook. So there's that. I'm going to pop these in the oven. I've got my oven preheating. It's not preheated yet. Uh, but I've got it preheating on 425. And the reason I have it so high is because I'm going to cook some biscuits here in a little bit. Um, to go with this. And they cook on 425. So I just set it on 425. That way it's ready when I'm ready to put the biscuits in. So I'm going to stick these in the oven and get them going. Their uh, provolone cheese goes on those, but I'm not going to put them on here right now. I'm, basically, all you're doing, everything's cooked. See, you know, if you can go back, we'll put the link down below for the uh, Friday's video on how I made those. Uh, but everything's cooked already. Everything's cooked already. The, those are just basically heating up and thawing out. and So you just cook them until they're... Uh, heated through. So, uh, I'm going to guess that they're probably going to take about, roughly about 30 minutes to cook. Uh, tonight, uh, we are having mashed potatoes with ours. If you want to follow, keep on the low carb theme, you could do mashed, um, cauliflower and, and replace for potatoes. We have had that before. I fixed it before and we really like it. It's really good, but honestly, we just kind of prefer potatoes. <laughs> And we're not on no low carb diet. We're just watching uh, how much we eat and uh, you know what we eat, eating you know healthier stuff, not a lot of junk and that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna get the potatoes ready to get them on the bowl. All right, I've done scrubbed my potatoes up. As you guys know, I do not peel my potatoes. Y'all getting a little crazy over there. So I'm going to get these in the pot. When you're mashing potatoes, you don't have to be as picky about how you slice them. Because they're going to be mashed up anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I don't know about you guys, but my rule of thumb when I'm fixing any kind of potatoes is one potato per person. So, this is for me and Rob. Emma won't eat mashed potatoes. So, this is for me and him. So, there's three in there. There's one each for us tonight and then one for him for lunch tomorrow. Alright. 
So, those are going to cook, boil, cook away, and then I'll mash those. But they're going to cook while the peppers are cooking. And uh, I done showed you guys how to make my biscuits. So, I will, pretty sure I have. Have I not done that? Okay. Thought I had. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, anyway, so I done showed you guys how to make the biscuits. So, I will bring you guys back when the peppers are done. And I'm getting ready to put the cheese on. Alright guys. So I've taken these out of the oven. They cooked uh, on. It was 425 for 30 minutes. And all honesty. Honest. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways. Um, I would not cook them 30 minutes. Next time I would cook them probably about. 15. Probably. Um. Uh, so, I'm going to put my cheese on them now, and my biscuits are in there cooking, so I'm going to stick these back in the oven uh, just to melt the cheese. So, uh, if you're not cooking the biscuits like I'm cooking the biscuits, then I would cook the peppers on 350 for 30 minutes, and that should be good. Uh, like I said, you're just warming them up, basically, and it's... If they're thawed, completely thawed out, where mine was still a little froze, if they're completely thawed out, they're not going to take as long. Probably about, you know, 350, about 15 minutes. You know, just keep an eye on them. It all depends on your oven and all that good stuff. So, uh, you're, like I said, you're just basically warming up. Everything's already cooked. So, I'm going to stick these back in the oven and get the cheese melted. And then I'll let you guys see them. Alright guys, so I've got it all done now. We've got uh, mashed potatoes, yum yum yum, biscuits, those are my uh, homemade drop biscuits, and then here is the low carb Philly cheesesteak stuffed peppers, and uh, with the provolone cheese on top of them, and uh, those look really good and they smell amazing. I'm starving. How about you? I'm starving. How about you? Yeah. <laughs> it was like I asked the question in dead silence. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah, you know, I've been waiting for these since I edited that video. <laughs> oh, last Friday's video. It was making me hungry then. <laughs> All right, guys. That it? I guess not. Unless you gonna fix something else? <laughs> nah. <laughs> we got ice cream in the freezer. Yeah. yeah. Well. We're gonna have cobbler Saturday at church. I think. Come on, make some cobblers. Maybe a big old pot of chili. Y'all might want to show up at our church Saturday if you. <laughs> Bored. We put you to work, and you get to eat. We eat good at the White Church. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this Tasty Tuesday episode. Until the next one, guys. Bye. <laughs>